Right, we just changed one side of the D1S xenon lights for the Alfa Romeo Mito. Um, I had a hard time figuring out or finding anything on the internet for this, um, so I thought I'd just make a very short video about it. You don't need to take off the bumper. Uh, many people will ask if there's a need for a bumper off repair to change the light bulb, but the only thing that you really need to do is uh, disconnect the battery because this is high voltage. And uh, what you need to do is take off this cap right here. And in there, here I took off the battery as well um, because it's, it is pretty tight. I'm still going to have to do this side. Uh, but in here, you basically have this. So what you need to do here is get the cable out. So the cable sits inside here. There's a tap on top here and on its other side. The only side that you get to is on this side. But if you pray with a, a flat screwdriver between them, it should come off. Um, the only side that you can damage is this side because this is waste anyway. Uh, so once you get that off, then if you look at it head on like this, uh, on this side, so the outer side of this housing on the butt, just about here, you can feel it with your hand in there, there's a lever. You push that lever down, then you can take this out pretty easily. And you just put the new one in and put the lever back on and the cap back on and you're done. I'm on the other side now. And the lever is on the outer side of this one as well. But you have to push it up. Instead of pushing that one, I had to push down. And this one has to be pushed up. So it's on that side. You can push that up. And then you can take it out. I ended up taking off this because it's way too, too tight in there. Um, I use this tool actually to um, pry off. This works very well. And it won't won't damage this much um, at all actually so yeah um, when you're putting it back in um, I'll show an image but it's it's kind of a claw thing that you put it in so be sure to get this um, straight once you put it in also when you unscrew this be sure to catch the the bolt because mine just fell down there yay Lights are working. Be sure to um, seal the cap back on. Um, I've read a lot about um, condensation in these lamps. So to avoid that, keep those caps pretty tight. And uh, yeah, that's it. Hope that helps.